Also this evening, a father of five murdered. His remains found in Lincoln County. Now, this case first made headlines earlier this month. And now, shocking new accusations are emerging as state agents piece together the murder of Brian Corrin. News Force Caitlin Ogle is in our newsroom with what investigators now say led up to his killing. Caitlin. Well, investigators say Brian Corey dated the woman that's now locked up. After he was killed, documents show she and another man, the other suspect, started a sexual relationship. Now, both suspects are blaming each other. Brian was a happy, fun-loving person to be around. Maybe kind of a lost soul, you might say. Brian Corey's father, remembering the father of five, the Iowa native moved to Kearney in Lincoln County. He just felt like he wanted to live in the great state of Oklahoma. At the time, Brian was living with his girlfriend, Janelle Brown. People in town say she was the friendly gas station clerk. Clyde Clayton also lived with them. Court documents say Brian promised Clayton he'd take him to Texas to see his family, but kept putting it off. Records show Brian would sometimes be gone for weeks, leaving Brown and Clayton at the home alone. In June, family called deputies because they hadn't heard from Brian since the 5th. Which is very unusual because uh, he called his brothers and sisters and kids and uh, me and my wife probably every day. Court documents say Brown told investigators she and Brian got into a fight that day. She went outside while both men did meth. He struggled with a couple addictions. When Brown came back at the house, she allegedly found Brian and a recliner, quote, slumped over and was shot in the neck. Meanwhile, Clayton told investigators he heard the shot, then Brown trying to open the door saying, did I hit him? The next day, Brown says she and Clayton burned Brian's body, the recliner and tile covered with blood. Clayton says he only replaced the tile with linoleum and replaced a door. Then in July, Brown led investigators to the remains. The remains were handed over to the Oklahoma Medical Examiner's Office for proper identification. It's just beyond our uh, comprehension. And investigators say Brian had a knee implant surgery, and in that burn pile, they found a metal knee implant. They also say Clyde Clayton is a person of interest in the case of a missing woman up in Iowa.